Welcome to the Pioneer Museum, and this is our story from out of the past. Come on in the research library. We're going to visit with somebody about some very important people in Fairmont's past. This is Lenny Tweeten, and today I'm going to visit with Mike Geary. Um, Mike's a longtime resident of Fairmont. Let's start out with Frank Wade, Mike. Uh, looking at this, what, uh, what can you tell us about Frank Wade from what you know about him and how and why he was important to Fairmont? Frank Wade has to be one of the outstanding people uh, and was a great promoter of our city. Uh, he started many uh, enterprises, endeavors, and uh, became uh, uh, a, a real promoter. He had a great vision of what Fairmont was, was to be. He came with a sufficient amount of capital <laughs> to uh, get a lot of things done for Fairmont. <laughs> and the amazing thing about Frank was he had, he had 13 years uh, here in Fairmont, and uh, the amazing thing was all the things that he accomplished in those 13 years. He started the uh, motors, he came here and uh, Got uh, bought the uh, bought the little uh, gas engine company from mm -hmm. Vic St. John and sure. Horace uh, Woolley. He was he was mayor of Fairmont. He was head of he started the utilities commission in Fairmont. He uh, bought the uh, boat livery uh, uh, oh, docks. Webster down Street at, down the foot of Webster Street. Yeah, right at Webster Street. Sure. He st he uh, started the. Uh, what is now the Bank Midwest, and prior to Bank Midwest was uh, the Fairmont National Bank. He um, went to, uh, I think he acquired uh, Interlochen in 1915. Uh, he bought the parcel of land between Hall Lake and Amber Lake mm -hmm. is about 38 acres. Mm -hmm. I think maybe a year or so later, uh, Frank Wade uh, purchased another 138 acres from okay. the Patterson Estate. The Interlock and the Inn was a beautiful place. Mm -hmm. uh, they had a, it was, uh, and was uh, uh, facing, it was on the highest point of the, uh, of the uh, south side of, of Hall Lake. Uh, it was a, uh, uh, I think they said 25 rooms to the east and 25 rooms to the west. Gee. And in the middle was the dining place. Mm -hmm. uh, and at one time, they had a racetrack. You know, the, the English oh, sure. loved races. Uh -huh. And wasn't there, weren't there other things? Like uh, there was a zoo out there too, wasn't there? Oh, guys, yes. You know, Lenny, Lenny Burton was a, uh, okay. was, Lenny Burton was um, uh, uh, one of the early settlers. And, uh -huh. and he took care of the zoo out there. Yeah, he was kind of a colorful yeah, he was person a colorful, in the history of the community. Yeah, it was. It just the building of the of the dance hall. The uh, you know, as a kid, I would roller skated out there. Sure. And that was a you know, you can't roller skate anywhere nowadays. <laughs> Towards Amber Lake, it was a natural amphitheater, mm -hmm. uh, and that's where uh, William Jennings Bryan. Bryan. You know, sure. I mm -hmm. don't know how many thousands of people. Uh, was there that day? Harold Wade started the. Uh, his son started the uh, C Camp Cedar Point. Okay. Uh, that which we're trying to get and preserve to this day. But it's one of the most beautiful spots. That was uh, a Boy Scout camp. The Boy Scout camp. All right. But it was amazing the short period of time uh, that he got this all all done. You know, and at the same time, uh, the motors, the the, uh, the Fairmont Railway motors which named, it eventually became the name mm -hmm. in World War I, uh, was very, very, uh, very productive, and they were internationally known. They were known. worldwide, yeah, they were yeah. all over the world. Yeah. He touched uh, the life in Fairmont in every vein, you know, bringing in electricity, bringing in uh, paved streets, uh, bringing in entertainment, the Interlochen Park, the scout camp, uh, bringing in the, the that's the greatest industrial uh, plant that we've had. It was the largest employer. Railway Motors. It was the Railway mm -hmm. Motors. And there's nothing that you can picture that he was ever self-serving. Mm -hmm. he, was, he was a wonderful man, and it's a great hero for our community. Well, Mike, thank you very much. Appreciate visiting with you, and uh, uh, come back again. It was, a, it was a nice recalling some old memories. This is Lenny Tweeten for our story from out of the past about Frank Wade.